Hey guys, how are you today? Um, Alright, so today we have used this embossing folder and we have embossed our little card here. Very pretty. Um, and I have this really, really funny stamp that I cannot wait to share with you guys. So let's move our card out of the way. And this is a stamp from Viva Las Vegas. And as you know, they have lots of kind of wild, crazy stamps, just really off the wall stamps and that kind of thing. So we are going to line her up. Um, as everyone knows, this month is Mother's Day. And um, unfortunately, my mother has passed away. And I really, beyond words, miss her. Um, so, and I usually get kind of depressed, kind of sad around this time of year. And um, so I decided to do something different. Like, usually I will do um, scrapbooks or something like that. Um, just maybe around the holiday, not just this holiday, but any holiday season or whatever. Um, but sometimes that just, you know, looking at old pictures and things like that kind of depressed me, honestly. <laughs> And uh, it's like good and bad at the same time. So I've decided to do something a little different. So throughout this month, occasionally I will be making some cards that remind me of my mom. Some I'll probably share stories with you as to why. And some, you know, I'll just kind of keep to myself, I guess. But um, so this is a stamp. Um, <laughs> but I want to do, I guess the difference is this year is I want to do funny things that remind me of her. To kind of put myself in a better mood and just kind of celebrate her life, not just mourn her, you know. So anyway, this is a wild lady um, who I feel like is on the phone all the time. And that my mother loved the phone, like loved, loved, loved her phone. And she would stay on there and talk to her sisters for like hours and hours. Um, and uh, <laughs> it was, you know, they have a really special relationship or had a really special relationship. Um, but uh, she could talk forever and everyone loved to talk to her they would just call and you know mom was um a, a night owl so she would be on the phone till you know one two o'clock in the morning every night she would kind of have her early talkers and then she would have her late talkers and um, my sandy who was probably the closest to her um was her late night talker so they would be on the phone forever so this kind of reminded me of her, um, 12 steps for people who talk too much on and on and on, get it, you know, like Alcoholics Anonymous, yeah, anyway, talk on and on and on, I just thought that was super cute. All right, so it makes me laugh, and I need that this time of year. So, um, all right, we are going to color her up a little bit, um, actually, I'll just kind of let that dry, it probably needs to dry a little bit. So, let me find cut out some dyes somewhere. I think this, yeah, that'll be big enough. Um, all right, so uh, let me find my tape. Okay, so, or should I pop? Oh, no, 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 let's pop dot it. <laughs> all right, um, because, you know, wouldn't be a card without it. Um, so I purchased my mom a um, she actually went to the AT&T store with me and one day and um, it was, I don't know, not necessarily when cell phones were becoming popular, but I guess sort of when she thought about them more. Um, and she did not know it, but um, I was going to switch my plan and I was going to, um, I told her I, I needed to go check on something, blah, blah, blah. I don't know what I said, but um, I had planned on getting her a phone as well. So... Uh, I hate. It drives me crazy when I make it show right there in between that little thing. Uh, I'll craft knife. I have to use the craft knife for that. It's going to drive me insane. Um, so anyway, we went in there and um, so I was looking at other phones and things like that and I talked to them about changing my plan and um, so I kind of surprised her and told her that I would get her one as well. And um, so we both got, I think that one was when we got the LG 4. Um, I was switching from an iPhone because um, I had met a lady, actually also at AT&T, um, that let me see her camera. And 
So mom and I both looked at that and we kind of just fell totally madly in love with that. Um, I'm also going to use this Regal Rose um, ribbon from Stampin' Up. And so let's just put a strip like this down across there so it will hold. Um, darn it. I need just a little bit more. Um, but anyway, so she was super excited. And um, she, I told the sales lady, just don't tell her how much it costs because, you know, um, mom was not a big spender. She was a big shopper, which, I don't know, like she'd go to the grocery store and spend bundles and bundles and the dollar store and things like that. And it didn't seem to matter. I mean, like she, she would spend hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars, but think that's no big deal. But she's, she is not going to pay, you know, 30 bucks for that shirt. No, 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 that's too much. So she could kind of justify it some places and some places not. Um, I thought that was funny, but, um, we, we did always like to go shopping and kind of browsing, looking at her. So anyway, I told the sales girl, do not tell her how much it is. Just, you know, I'll sign it. I'll whatever. I'll take care of it. Don't worry about it. Um, or else she would have been freaking out. So, but anyway, um, I actually just got that phone paid off just now. Um, my, my father actually uses it some, which makes me happy because he has def definitely never been a phone guy either by any means, um, and he is, like, being able to look on Facebook and do different things, so I'm really excited about that, um, and my mom, um, she actually, um, she knew way more about the phone than I ever did, like, so we both got the same phone, um, at that time, and hers lasted, mine did not, but whatever, um, had all kinds of trouble out of mine, but anyway, um, she really shocked me by, um, it was, it was great. Um, where's my gray? Okay. I'm going to give this lady some gray hair. I just imagine her talking. Um, and my mom went gray, um, probably, I don't know, 10 years ago, something like that. She had gorgeous hair, I thought. Um, but anyway, um, so let's do this rose pink. Anyway, she def definitely bypassed me. I mean, she would stay on that phone constantly. That was definitely by far the best gift I've ever gotten her, I think. Um, and even my father said so. He's like, I, you know, he wishes that he would have gotten it because she loved it so much. And, um, but I was definitely, you know, very happy to, to have gotten that for her. Um, because it did seem to bring, bring her pleasure. <laughs> and, uh. But like I said, she definitely bypassed me by learning, you know, all the ins and outs. And she was downloading apps and using this and that and getting her grocery store stuff and her coupons. And, you know, she was FaceTiming and just <laughs> all kinds of stuff. Um, and I found myself saying, Mom, you know, how do you do this? And she, doo -doo -doo, there you go. <laughs> and uh, so she would actually show me. So that was pretty cool. Um but, um, dad and I both <laughs> treat mom's phone like it's gold. Like if something ever happens to that phone, I think we'll cry our eyes out, you know, just cause it reminds us of her, I guess. Um, but, um, anyway, uh, all right, color that up. I love this big cool flower in her hair and I think we're going to color the phone I can't hardly see it, to be honest. Like, I don't, I know it's there because I see this cord. So I'm going to do the cord a bright yellow. So I feel like there it is. You can't miss it. But it's hard to, like, see down here. You just feel like she's holding it, smoking her cigarette, which my mother didn't smoke. But, you know, it's still, it's pretty, just a cool image. Um, but anyway, um, so, yeah, this lady, um, my mom would have gotten a kick out of her. She actually um, would help me craft. She wasn't exactly a crafter, she, but she did quilt and things like that. So she was definitely creative in that way and a crafter in that area, just not card making. But she would, um, she would kind of help me at the end of card making, as I call it. Um, let's see what time I'm on. Okay, nine minutes. We're good. Um, she would. Uh, Let's put, hmm, before we get too far, I want to add this little feather. Um, 
but she would say she's good at adjusting, not card making. <laughs> and what that meant was I would make a card and then, you know how sometimes you make a card and you just need, like, you just look at it and you know it needs something else, like just another little bip or bop or, you know, moving around or whatever. Um, she was really good at saying, you know, well, why don't you move that over there or add some buttons or, you know, something like that. So once I came up with the general design, um, she could kind of help me fine tune it. And so we enjoyed that. And um, she would um, uh, kind of get a kind of worry about me for shopping too much, but kind of get a kick out of it at the same time. Um, because, and usually I would take her with me wherever we were going, whatever stamp place or this or that, and we would um, kind of have some girls' time. Mom was always up for going out, going out to eat. She loved to eat, like me. <laughs> and um, so uh, um, it's a little different with my dad, although he loves to eat. He's like, whoa, whoa, the price is, it's too high. It's, you know, you're going to pay what for what? No, oh, let's go to Golden Corral. That's a way better deal. And he th he compares everything to Golden Corral. He thinks the buffets are the way to go. Which, hey, I like a good buffet too, so I'm not knocking that. Um, but, you know, like, you know, he just thinks ordering off the menu, like, oh, you just can't get your money's worth. So it's cute. Um, but uh, anyway, so we go out sometimes and things now, but... Um, but mom would, man, if the wheels would roll, she was right there and she was ready to go. So I do miss that. Um, all right. So let's put that there. And, um, and that's one of the things, honestly, that everybody, darn it. Did I miss that with the craft knife? I'm afraid I'm going to cut it if I do it on the card. Huh, may have to stick a flower or something over that. Cause I can't, I'm afraid to do that now. All right, let's see, what else can we add? Let's add that big old jewel, but let's do the inside first, kind of think of it. All right, so we are going to use this to layer it. Um, but anyway, that's the thing that everybody misses the most, I think, about her is um, calling and chatting with her. And my aunt, Sandy especially, um, this is their, their late night chats and things. And, um, you know, and mom was like, I had a summer schedule, of course, because I work in the school system. So um, we would always stay up late and, you know, we would talk about or watch the um, the cooking shows or, you know, she was always like, she could outlast me shopping, eating, staying up late, whatever it was. Like, you know, <laughs> she was a trooper. She truly was. So, um, all right. So let's put some sticky glue here on there so how many of you guys like to talk on the phone I'm honestly not a phone talker I'm a texter I like to text but I honestly do not like to talk on the phone and I enjoy it less and less all the time to be honest um, I'm so glad that texting has come around because I just I don't know I just don't like the phone <laughs> but I love it for you know like everything else if that makes sense so, I feel like, eh, it's a bit much. Okay, so maybe we're close to done. Let's add a couple of these, though. We're at 13 minutes. I think I can get a few of these on, hopefully. Um, just these little pink, you know how I like to add little, little doodads here and there. Nothing is complete without some bling to me. Just like the tape. I got it's gotta have tape and it's gotta have some of these little suckers. So after that, everything else is gravy. Alright, so um I guess yeah. That's a little close. Should have scooted her down just a little bit more. But anyway, all right, guys, so what do you think of this crazy little lady card? And I can just hear her gossiping and saying, girl, did you hear? Uh, mm -hmm. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.